Hello traders, it's Samurai Trader here. Welcome to session 60. How did they trade any market? So what I teach you here in today's session, you can apply to the futures, forex or stock markets. You'll see that uh, my average uh, daily target is $1,000. Usually I'll net that well and truly in under an hour. However, you still need to be allowing two to three hours a day. Okay, uh, we've got to allow for some preparation time, etc. Now, if you're a young gun, particularly $1,000 a day, not enough, you simply increase the position size, the number of contracts you're going to be trading. As you'll see, I trade five lots on the NQ. Now, very, very important traders, uh, you can apply this to any market. In fact, we've got a lot of members that trade oil. Now, uh, the Texas T they trade the ES we've got other members that are on the Dow it all comes down to let's remember money management following our rules trading like a casino now what we can see here is that if you were trading oil as an example I would recommend that you have a $5,000 account yes I know uh, the day trading margins are much less however we never risk any more than 2% why we're in this business long term you start risking five and ten percent I'm sorry but the trading gods are going to come and drain your bank account and give me your money very important we follow the rules so I won't go into all of these rules right now except to say if you're trading what I call a two tick or a 233 a two tick Renko or say a 233 tick uh, tick chart you're probably going to need around the four to five thousand dollar margin or account now the beautiful thing is you can start off with the micro 10% of a value and if you go for just 300 a day you can turn that or have the potential of turning that five thousand dollars into a ten thousand dollar a week income within nine weeks and that is on the basis you only buy another start uh, yeah, sorry let me say that again you only start trading an additional contract each time you double your money so I can put in some ridiculous figures here we can say for a full-time trader really 500 a day is very realistic look where you are in five weeks however there's nothing worse than going for a target which is not realistic when you first start day trading you've got to have realistic target so even though I'm talking about the NQ here you can apply you can trade any market providing you've got some volume and some volatility now in the last video I spoke about trading like a casino and one thing I failed to really say is that the casino has the house edge what is a house edge or what for us what's the edge an edge is that there's a higher probability of one thing happening over another say a higher probability of over 20 trades so we know we may have one two three four losing trades in a row it's not too often I'll have four losing trades in a row however I also know there's a good chance I'll have five six ten winning trades in a row it's about probabilities there are no certainties in trading but there are probabilities now our trading edge as day traders is further improved by only trading rules based pattern based strategies applying discipline patience and money management and thinking and trading in probabilities in other words thinking and trading as a casino would that's what we need to be doing traders and so I'll hopefully try to demonstrate that in this video and I know some traders already skipping forward they don't want to hear this trading truly is 90% head stuff 5% money management and 5% the strategy itself now very quick advertisement uh, I'm about to release a uh, an on-demand web webinar where you'll be able to see some of my live trading uh, if you haven't already got my ebook um, uh, or one of my spreadsheets here like the compound spreadsheet I just uh, mentioned you can you, um, these you can download free of charge by doing that also I'll send you the link as soon as it's finished I've recorded the main video I've just got to do a couple of things on the end of it uh, and you'll be able to watch exactly how I trade watch and listen as I trade so make sure you download that you'll be kept up to date also with all my latest 
uh, videos and even better still become a member traders there's nothing else like this out there okay you don't have to come and do my personal one-on-one -on -one. you don't have to join my live trading room for $197 you get so all of my indicators 38 powerpoints there's hundreds of hours of recordings there's just look it's literally a gold mine as members will tell you uh, and I've got a little special going at the moment where you can also attend eight of my live coaching sessions that is each week 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. Tuesdays and Thursday uh, sorry Tuesdays and Wednesdays 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time I run uh, a live coaching session and this is beside my live trading room where I'm teaching you the setups how to trade uh, psychology of trading money management we just go through so many things and there's a ton of uh, handouts here now that's included for your first month now after month one if you wish to uh, uh, continue it's $97 a month that's $197 on the website but that's something you subscribe to later so when you become a member at 197 uh, you're not signing up for that you've got to let me know if you'd like to go ahead with that so with this one ah this is the uh, okay I didn't update this did I update that yes I did okay this is from uh, the prior session so anyway in this one in less than 30 minutes of day trading I had um, six trades for five wins net commission thereafter uh, it was 1300 gross exactly 1191 um, uh, in those particular trades now I'll go through these uh, on the charts for you because there's some nice little things before and after I usually like to show you so trade one um, you'll see in a moment so it's three pages there I had a bet the farm members you know what that is we'll have we have a lot of members watch this okay so we were um, uh, six trades in total and I'll talk about this divergence trade uh, just down here uh, in a moment now look I'm not going to go through in this session what it really means starting off with a three and a half thousand dollar account where you can be but the potential traders is, is huge it truly is within you can be earning a full-time income trading part-time within a matter of weeks but the thing you've got to put in is the work that is the only place I know in the world where sick success comes before work is in a dictionary unfortunately most traders are not willing to put the work in now it's not difficult it's a matter of some screen time learning the rules etc spending a couple of days a week in mastering our day trading but what would an extra ten thousand dollars a week mean to you and your family that is the true potential however it's like you know everyone wants to see the view from the top of the mountain but no one wants to climb the mountain to see the view it's like um, you know the allure of riches in day trading is great everyone wants to get rich quickly but that's not the reality you get rich slowly but it doesn't take a huge amount of time so I won't go through this today because I want to get really straight to the charts but first of all I want to talk about this you've heard me talk about if you've seen my videos about my what I call my secret weapons well there's no real great secret about them it's just I know they're the critical ingredients number one is trading in the direction of a higher time frame I actually use two anchor charts an anchor chart one and an anchor chart two and what I'm really looking for on anchor chart two it's very simple trend direction and major EMA bounces okay and it just takes a bit of getting used to looking at those but it's not difficult you've just got to put the screen time in the second secret weapon I have is understanding how to trade pivots in areas of support and resistance now fortunately with all great trading platforms such as ninja trader uh, uh, and I have no affiliation with ninja trader but it's a fantastic uh, platform and many others now you can plot areas like pivot levels your open high low, low and close your EMAs of course uh, even we've even got swing indicators the current days high and low as you'll see in today's video all of these are plotted automatically you don't have to go and spend hundreds or thousands of dollars on indicators I've got them here free of charge for you and if you're into round numbers particularly if you trade oil you do want to know about round numbers so you want to learn how to trade these why 
because I mean the difference between success and failure as a trader so as I mentioned here I had six trades for five wins so let's get to the charts and check these out so let me minimize this and get to this so first of all uh, this is 1:33 a.m. Central Standard Time now you can trade any time you wish okay so if I keep scrolling back you'll just see this trade after trade now this is on the NQ now the reason I'm choosing the NQ here is you get some incredible volatility now volatility is good but it's not always good that is the market can move sometimes that quickly that you just can't get the trade on that's when then we need to increase the time frame for an example right here I'm trading a four tick Renko now with a four tick Renko forget it once you get into the London session and New York right near impossible to trade now I know one of my members Paul he'll say that's not correct but he's got a little strategy down he, he loves to trade it for me I go and trade say a two tick um, during the New York session it chokes up my charts okay so this works really well from 6 p.m. Eastern usually up to about uh, 3 a.m. Uh, Eastern okay you'll find you can trade the full tick now if it takes off like a rocket it's just a matter of sitting on hands until the market slows down now the reason I bring that up sometimes um, our potential traders will say oh you can never you can't trade this at all during New York of course you can't so you change the time frames okay so here for an example during the New York hours we're going to jump from uh, an 8 tick up to a 12 and maybe even up to a 16 tick now the point there is that will also then affect the account size that you then require so if you're trading with a really small account uh, yes you can start off on the micros but maybe you want to start trading the the uh, 8 tick Renko but we need to consider the account size that you've got with all of these now by the way the 8 tick Renko in the afternoon session of New York can work really well probably 80 90 percent of the time okay and if we're trading the 8 tick a sensible target is 500 a day for that contract okay now uh, let me just uh, as an example give you this now if you're trading and I may as well just show you this I recommend if you're going to trade the 8 tick you'd need ideally about seven and a half thousand dollars in your account now I know what some of you are thinking that's not true my broker said I can get I can have just 500 in my account that is correct that is true but then you go and have a loss that's hundred and fifty dollars or one hundred dollars what's happened then you see if you trade a too small a time frame or your stop is too small you're going to get whipsawed you're going to get stopped out all the time these are the things that a lot of people don't want that they don't want to tell you they want to flog you their wares and that you don't know the reality most traders don't know the reality so if you don't have seven and a half thousand dollars you start off with 750 on the micros and build from there so here if you start with five, uh, seven and a half so let's just say here you've done your training in 90 days you're ready to go live you're going for 500 a day which is typically four to five net trades after any losses look where you are in seven weeks that's the income potential and your account size is now 46,000 now on the other hand if we go and say okay I'm going to trade the micro and I'm going to start off with $750 trade uh, trade the micro and I go for just $50 a day 10% of a cost okay so within uh, nine ten weeks within nine weeks you've got eight thousand in your account then you can start trading the big contract and as most of you are aware you only start trading additional contract every time you double your money and no you would never be trading 30 40 100 micro lots because as soon as you build your account you want to move from the micro to the big contract because it works out to be you're going to pay an extra 200% in commissions in other words on a standard contract 
uh, you're going to be paying somewhere depending on your broker uh, somewhere between four dollars twenty or actually four dollars eighteen and five dollars fifty per contract on the big contract on the micros though you're going to pay somewhere from a dollar twenty two up to a dollar fifty so what that means is because of 10% of a value let's just say a um, dollar fifty you're paying fifteen dollars to trade ten micros compared to say about four fifty four eighty to trade a standard contract and you'll be amazed at the difference that makes in your bottom line you really will but this is a great starting point just wanted to uh, really get that across to you so let's get to um, our trade so on the way down there's a ton of opportunities now uh, my main EMA is here of a 289 this is the low of day so you can see here we keep hitting the low of day remember I said to you as a, um, a pivot magnet actually if we go back to the PowerPoint here for a moment these are the critical areas you've got to learn so whenever we take a trade we're always saying to ourselves do I have blue skies ahead and what I mean by that when we take a trade what's in front of me what I can see down here I've got the low of day I've now got why did I take the trade there instead of say there <clears throat> excuse me well I only logged in but then that made that a beautiful trade because this is um, um, uh, what I call a bet the farm in the direction of the trend okay I actually had a late entry and where was my um, target two ticks above the fee above the low of day and it come down at it and I was very lucky there I got out there right on um, the tick normally speaking that doesn't happen normally we'll get a bounce it will come up and uh, and what actually happens is I'll usually get out with at what I call five to seven steps each one of these steps by the way is worth ten dollars per contract um, now here in this case I went for a larger target normally I'm after seventy dollars per contract in these moves I'm a scalper love to get in get out here I was after a much larger target why I was targeting the low of day thank you very much got nicely filled now there are then a number of other excellent trading opportunities now uh, I was preparing for my live trading room so what I actually did then I um, rebooted my PC and I want to show you um, I'll scroll ahead in a moment uh, a major well it's not a major yeah it is and it's a very expensive error I made and so with that being said also one thing I run every day is my virus protectors on but then I'll do a quick run over run it again a quick scan and I reboot my computer twice a day okay I'll also clear the cache okay so there's a number of things we want to be doing uh, each and every day so let me just scroll ahead here very quickly and I think my first trade there was about 219 so I rebooted my PC some beautiful potential opportunities there and as I then pulled back that was a that's a no-brainer there by the way so is this one here but anyway coming back here then start to pull back uh, must be getting close to this now and pulling back well we're nearly there nearly there okay are we nearly there okay whoops patience everyone <laughs> we're just about there okay we pull back pull back no we pull down ah okay I must be getting very close to a setup here now because this is a, a golden type of area I would be going for and just up here is this it here it is right here finally at last okay and by the way that was a golden opportunity so was that one they were no-brainers and that was a uh, just a beautiful 2d there now what I had uh, just here traders was a setup called a bet the farm so for members watching this let me just show you that so look over on the right there uh, on your anchor chart you can see the double top you've got that beautiful bet the farm trade just there so I shorted this here 
put my uh, stop one tick uh, yes the four tick sorry just making sure it's on the four tick one tick above and down we went thank you very much and I was out got my full seven steps we then uh, I didn't take anything here I then pulled back this is that was trade two by the way I'm pulling back here trade number three so you can see here I've got my 200 EMAs in a downtrend oh that's right let me explain the error I made I changed um, uh, my stop loss requirements and I when I rebooted I hadn't set it up as a template so it automatically came up that uh, I was only shorting one contract instead of five and I didn't check so one of the things there I've got a daily checklist you're meant to uh, and meant to be checking every day such as on your matrix do you have the right market if you trade different markets do you have the right market on your matrix do you have the right number of contracts on there are you trading the right template that is um, uh, for the right target and stop very simple uh, things but very simple and easy not to do okay and so I shorted this for a beautiful trade and only shorted one contract so that was a very expensive mistake easy to do traders very easy anyway we then pulled back here and then finally I shorted um, I got it right shorted five contracts uh, just here and guess what I'm targeting the low of day okay but what I'll do is front run and you can see there I actually got out a number of ticks before for low of day this is what I call front running now it actually pumped through and I left well did I leave any money on the table well not really because quite often you'll come down and you'll bounce off these levels so you know you could say okay well you can always trail etc I'm a scalper as a scalper I prefer fixed targets I'm in and out very quickly now I then took this divergence trade okay it was a 2d uh, this is trade number four it's what I call a 2d a double divergence and I immediately got stopped out of that trade in two minutes I was stopped out I then had another 2d set up off the low of day now notice this one is also off the low of day some of your best reversal trades or divergence trades will come off pivots prior days open high low and close and the low or the high of day the low or the high of day and thank you very much okay and trade number six was a no-brainer again basically modeling um, this over here and uh, down we come thank you very much and we then reversed and in fact straight after that traders uh, for the members that are here uh, you had a classic t10 that you could have uh, uh, jumped on right there and that rallied up uh, really nicely okay that was almost a t3 just there so that was five out of six net of commissions 1191.32 now the first trade took three minutes uh, and trades two to six were over in 10 minutes it was fairly fast now what if that's too fast for you well here I've got a four tick you might jump up to a six tick or even an eight tick Renko once again 28 years of experience it makes it a lot easier for me to get in and out uh, but for newer traders if it's too fast increase the time frame however you also then need to follow your money management rules now this is for Renko charts but the same rules apply for tick charts as we increase the time frame we then need to allow a larger account size now if you don't do this traders you will lose your money that is if you don't follow your trading rules if you keep breaking your rules when it comes to money management and what actually happens is over a period of time it also erodes your confidence the greatest possible career you could have ever imagined for financial freedom you can only dream about you can get going for four five hundred dollars and potentially within six months financial independence for life
however if you cut the corners okay you're gonna blow that opportunity so day trading is not for gamblers now on the other hand what if you do have a gambling mentality we can deal with that we have when we can use our NLP techniques reframing techniques uh, and that's a big thing is the psychology of trading how do we handle that we've got the support there I can give you I've even gone as far as high hiring a trading psychologist and hypnotherapist so I've actually had recorded for my members hypnotherapy sessions that you can download off off the members area and listen to go and lay down in the afternoon and listen to your hypnotherapy sessions on following the rules so if trading hasn't been good for you up to now we can do something about it if you're serious but what I tend to find when it comes to traders we've got two types we've got the trader that will do what is they're, they're interested and they'll do only what's convenient you know there's um, uh, a good TV program on tonight so rather than attending the coaching session they prefer to go and watch the price is right okay? <laughs> or whatever it may be then you got the traders that will do whatever it takes the committed trader they'll do whatever it takes because they know that time will pass and where they end up in six months time is based upon what they do today traders you can do this provided you can develop the discipline uh, and the patience it's not rocket science but when we project forward and see what it means to us and our families it's an incredible opportunity okay traders I'll finish up right there okay so come and join me come and join us in our classes so once again traders I love day trading and this is session 60 and um, I'll see you in my next session hopefully I'll see you in either my live trading room or the coaching room thank you traders